you don't know where to begin, better ask when. Winston, very good to see you. Today we're talking about happy retired couples. They are also financially healthy. Today we're taking a closer look at the topics that successful couples ask one another in order to become happy and successful in retirees. And you say, first, you need to discuss retirement expectations long before you've retired. Long before you retire. You know, the biggest challenge that people have is that they, they during their working years, they're accumulators, they're savers. And they are getting ready to get to a, uh, a figurative finish line. That's retirement, where they, they, the, the paradigm shifts. They, they are no longer savers and accumulators. They transform into spenders. And they're having to uh, you know, eat what they harvest. And, and what they sow comes into play for the next 25 to 35 years. Mm -hmm. And you, you just said retirement planners often get you to retirement, but you as a holistic planner, it's to and through retirement. It's about having That's this right. conversation with the couple. That's right. We, we're a very different type of a firm than right. the typical uh, stockbroker that is managing your investment portfolio. There's so much more to retirement than just your investment portfolio. We specialize in the five major areas of retirement. Income planning is always number one. Fiduciary investment advisory, that's number two. Number three is high level tax planning. Okay, that's very important. Number four is when you start looking at health care and Medicare and long term care, that's all part of our process that's integrated into our retirement flight plan. And lastly, wills, trusts, powers of attorney, that's called legacy planning. All five of those areas come into play when you cross that finish line into retirement. And of course, you know, you say you need to regularly discuss current and future income and spending together. Studies show that couples with long-term financial happiness have those joint financial discussions. That's right. Communication is key, not just between husband and wife, but between the husband and wife as a unit and the financial advisor. Mm -hmm. Having a well-rounded plan, again, we call ours the retirement flight plan, aids in that communication every six months, annual reviews. Whenever we get together, we're constantly going through that checklist and understanding where the money is coming in from and where it's going out to. Real mm -hmm. important. Right. And last, you say you need to acknowledge differing needs and wants. I think that's good advice for any relationship. <laughs> That's right. You know, you'll you'll sometimes find spouses that have very differing viewpoints. Uh, uh, I'm thinking of one of our clients where the, the the wife she just loves to travel and she does and she travels extensively. And her husband he's seen enough. He stays home. Okay. And the the expenses that are incurred from all the traveling are significant, but they've communicated with each other and they're both comfortable and they're finding a happy medium in doing that. That is great, especially when we have a part in that and making sure that the portfolio is well balanced and the income is guaranteed. Right. Well said. Winston, if somebody wants to start having this conversation with you and their significant other, what's the best way to reach you? Well, one of the ways you can reach us, of course, is online at winstonandcompanies.com. That's winstonandcompanies.com. Or you can reach out and call us on the phone, 602-456-1928. All right, Winston, thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Got a plan for your retirement, because you know it's just down the road. But if you don't know where to begin, better ask when.